Chatbase lets you build a custom chat GPT for your website. The end product is going to be a chat widget like this that you can add to your website or an iframe like this that you can embed on any page of your website. So let's build a chatbot. First, you choose the data source. It can be files like Word documents, PDFs, .txt files, etc. It can be text, so you can just paste text here, or it can be a website. For this demo, I'm going to do the product hunt launch guide. So I'm going to put this here and then say fetch links. What this will do is that it's going to go to product hunt and get me all the links that start with slash launch. So all of these links. So I'm going to say create chatbot using all of the data in these links. So now I have a chatbot that knows all of the data inside of these links. But before I ask it questions, I'm going to go to the settings and change a few things. First, I'm going to change the base prompt. So the base prompt is the system message that you can give um, your chatbot any instructions. So you can give your chatbot a name, a personality, and any set of instructions you can think of. So think of this as you're giving your chatbot its persona, or you're giving your website or your blog or your company a persona, and then making a chatbot using that. So for this demo, I'm going to say your name is Product Hunt AI. And then I'm going to keep this the same, but you can give it a personality. You can say, I want you to be funny. I want you to stay serious. You can just give it any set of instructions. And then I'm going to change the chat interface. So I actually like the this waving emoji. So I'm going to put this here. Then I'm going to say, hi, I am product hunt AI. Then what can I help you with? And then the suggested messages are the messages that show up here. So I'm going to say the first message is going to be, what is product hunt? The second one will be how to have a successful launch. Then you can change the theme. And then you can add a logo for your chatbot like this and give it a display name. So I'm going to call it product hunt. And I'm going to change the user message message color. So I'm going to make it the product hunt orange. So where did it go? Oh. So this color, make it dark. Nice. And then I'm going to save this. And then I'm going to click on embed chatbot. I'm going to make my chatbot private because by default it's... Uh, I'm going to make it public because by default it's private. And then set my domains, example.com. Then now you get an iframe. So you can add this to any page of your website or a script tag to uh, have a chat bubble like this. So I'm going to copy the script tag, paste it here. So this is a completely different website. And then I'm going to launch this. So now I have my chat bubble on this new website. And then this knows everything about Product Hunt or knows everything about the launch guide. So I'm going to say how to have a successful launch. And it is answering using the information here. Hope you like it. And let me know if you have any questions or you want any more features.